Kayla, and I know this video is awful quality, awful lighting, and my hair is wet. Anyway, but this is just a quick video. My camera is still kind of packed away. I'm just obviously home, coming home for winter break. But I wanted to um, get this video up because it's actually the 15th, and I haven't done my day 7 through 12 of my benefit advent calendar yet. So I'm going to go through and do that, and then I have an announcement to make at the end of the video. So, day seven was the Ultra Plush Lip Gloss in a Lister, which I know you're not going to see very well. This looks like that. It's a pretty pink color, and I really like it so far. Um, I actually wanted to buy this one, and then I now I don't have to because it was in my advent calendar, so that's really awesome. Um, day eight was High Beam, um, which if you don't know that is it's a highlighter. Um, yeah, it just comes like the tints do, so like on a little brushy majigger. That was a really technical term. And, um, yeah, but it's just a nice highlight. I have this. I love it. Um, yeah. So, High Beam. It's one of their m many brilliant highlighters. There's, like, three, I think. Yeah, I think they have three highlighters, and I love that this is by far my favorite. I think I also have, um, What's Up is the other one I have. Um, day nine was That Gal Brightening Face Primer. So, it's just a primer obviously for your foundation and it's brightening so if I go through the color wheel of what is brightening it should be pink and it is I don't know if you can really see I kind of can so yeah it is pink um but it obviously doesn't go on pink it smooths out and it's clear and then it brightens your face day 10 right so day 9 yeah day 10 was also a primer of sorts um <laughs> It is the Professional, which just looks like this, the little bitty one. And basically it's just a pore minimizing primer. Like, you put it on underneath your foundation, and it makes your pores disappear, or all but disappear. Um, yeah, so that's that. I've used that before, too. Um, day 11 was the Bad Gal Liner Waterproof in Black, which actually I think Bad Gal Liner only comes in black. Um, but yeah. Just a little mini eyeliner, and you can never go wrong with an eyeliner. You can't really see where it says bad gal. A, because it's upside down, and B, because it's really tiny and written in purple. Um, and then day 12 was the uh, Total Moisture Facial Cream, which I have used before. I got a sample of it in a Sephora or Ulta package once that I got. And I wasn't crazy about it, but again, I'll test it out, and I'll try it um, again, because... I have a bigger sample of it this time. I can use it for more than two days. So, I might try it out again, see what I think about it. Um, but yeah, so, that was this week. And so it was a lip gloss, a highlighter, two primers, a moisturizer, and an eyeliner. So a lot of face products this week. Um, yeah. I'm hoping, let's see, last week was a lot of um, eye. So there's an eye primer eye cream. So, I mean, I guess we're doing good. There's been a lot of primers, though. There's an eye primer and now two face primers just in the first 12 days. So, I'm excited to see the rest of the days. If you follow me on Instagram, you've already seen days 13, 14, and 15. No, nope, you haven't seen 15 yet. I haven't done 15 yet. 15 will be going out probably right when this video is. Um, yeah, and then I'm going to cheat and open 16 and 17 today because I have to go back to school for finals, and I'm not going to bring my advent calendar back with me. So I'm not going to upload those pictures yet. Those you'll have to wait until the right days. But I have to open them and take the pictures so I can upload them on time. But yeah, so that is days 7 through 12. And then my little announcement, which if you've been on my channel since yesterday, um, or if you're on Twitter and you see what I retweet, um, you would know that I am a style haul partner now, and I'm super excited about it. Um, yeah, so just the nice next step on my channel, and I can't wait to see where the next few months and years and forever bring YouTube stuff with me. So, um, thanks you, all of you, for being a part of this wonderful journey, and I can't wait to see where the future takes us. So, sorry for this awful quality video. I just wanted to get something up for you guys, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!